Alright. Here we go. Cell division. Cells are small. When they start, when they grow, they get bigger. They can only get a certain size. Do you remember why? Because surface, surface area, 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 area to volume ratio. Yeah. Are you recording now? How good are you? <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> once they get a certain size, they don't have enough surface area, so they need to divide, and that gives them more surface area. Okay. The lock? Who's that? And that. Oh, no. <laughs> So, we see the cell looks a certain way when it's about to divide, and we call that mitosis. And so, it, there, are, there are really five phases to the cell cycle. If, Matt, six phases. No, I put paper mache around the cat. I put paper mache around the and then test cord. Around the cat. No, around the cat. Around the cat. I put paper mache around the cat. Are y'all? What are y'all doing here? Yeah, you don't have to be quiet. Need to be, need to be listening. We're, we're out. We're not here. Um. So here is a cell. This this whole big thing is a cell. They're actually smaller than this. <laughs> And here's the nucleus of the cell. And so, after interphase, which is just normal cell life, the cell suddenly goes into prophase. And various things happen. I just remembered. Are we doing early prophase or short prophase? Prophase. 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 I forgot my century Oh, oh no. those. There they are. Those. Yeah. Those are not century <laughs> well, That's the way you have it. Oh, <laughs> so, prophase. Prophase, the chromatin that was all scattered out coils into these units called chromosomes. It coils up real tightly. The DNA? The, the, the DNA is, is normally just loose in the nucleus. It's called chromatin. But when the cell's ready to divide, all of a sudden it coils up into these chromosomes. The DNA is actually laying there in the nucleus in a human cell in 46 pieces. And they each coil up where you can see them, and they look like little X's. Now, I only have six on the board, but you have to imagine in an actual human cell, there'd be 46. In a fruit fly cell, there'd only be four. Humans have more chromosomes than fruit flies. Is, it, so. is the one called a chromatid, or is that another thing? This is a chromatid. Okay. This is a chromatid. Good. Since they're exactly alike, they're sister chromatids. The whole thing is a chromosome. Okay? Now, why is there an exact copy? Why, why, have, why not just have one? Why have two copies? Because uh, one that one is very Because you're going to separate, you're going to divide the cell in two, and each new cell needs a copy of, of, of each chromosome. So back during interphase, the cell copied its DNA. Do you remember which phase of interphase it copied its DNA? There's three phases S. to interphase. S, yes. In the S phase, if you remember, interphase G1, S, G2. has three parts to it. This is all interphase right here. G1, cell's just growing. S, DNA replication, it's copying its DNA. G2, more growing. <laughs> and final preparations. And then we go through the six. Or the rest of them, prophase, prometaphase, metaphase, antiphase, cultrase, cytokinesis. Okay? Ooh, there's some different chromosome numbers. Corn, 20 chromosomes. Southern adder's tongue fern, 1,320 chromosomes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? 
A lot of chromosomes. A lot of chromosomes for Ophioglossum vulgatum. <laughs> do any have six? Humans? No, do any animal. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, not on this chart. Because we, we, we want, we want for six, because that's how many we have. So that, we yeah, have. we'll need to figure that out. Why don't you do that for me? Figure that <laughs> out. Get on the internet. Okay. Okay, so, prophase, these things coil up. That's one thing that happens. What's another thing that happens? Do you remember? The nuclear um, Something to do with this eraser. The nuclear membrane dissolves. The nuclear membrane dissolves. Why would the nuclear membrane dissolve? So well, we want to move these things around, and it's hard to do with a nuclear membrane around. No kidding. Have you ever tried to move chromosomes? Yeah, you can't do it. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Another important thing really small. is these so centrioles start moving okay. towards opposite sides. And this Even though these aren't centrioles. This and they start sides. shooting out spindle fibers. Spindle fibers. Spindle fibers. This is still the This chromosome. is part of chromatophase. <laughs> this is still prophase. Okay. Uh, now, prometaphase. Is when these things, when the when the spindle fibers actually hit the chromosomes, and the chromosomes grab onto the spindle fibers, that's pretty much prometaphase. Yeah. What what's, what's the part? What what are these? These, these are centrioles. called centrioles. centrioles. Centrioles are little little organs organelles that have spindle fibers shooting from them. And it was thought that, well, hey, these things must make spindle fibers. But in plant cells, they have spindle fibers coming out of an area, but there's no centrioles. They only like combine to form a centrosome. Yeah, the two together is called a centrosome. Or this this area where the spindle fibers coming out of is called a centrosome. So like in prophase, two centrosomes like. A Two centrosomes divide and move to opposite yeah. sides. Well, the centrioles, yeah, yeah, same thing. And like each one has a centriole yeah. in it, yeah. And do they attach to this, um, what's it called? The this, this region is called the centromere. Centromere. Do centromere, the spindle fiber attaches to the centromere. It, but that's uh, not yet. That's in yeah, that's in prometaphase. That's where we are right now. You see them right here attaching? Prometaphase. And now some of the spindle fibers aren't attached to anything. They just go all the way across. And hit other spindle fibers. And you have other spindle fibers going in the opposite direction, anchoring the centrioles to the cell, to the plasma membrane. I don't think you What's the kinetic? We call those asters. You never told us that before. Yeah, it, yeah. That aster pastella, I like those. <laughs> what is the kinetic one? Um, the kinetochore is a fiber that is hitting the um, uh, the centromere. The center, yeah. Actually, the centromere consists of a of two kinetochores. Oh, the okay. little yellow dots. So kinetochore. And so a kinetochore spindle fiber is a spindle fiber that's hitting one of the kinetochores. Yeah, you don't have to say what it is. Yeah. That's a little. You don't have to uh, it was, that it was on the test, and it was in between kinetochore and centromere. And I picked kinetochore, and I got it wrong. Each, this is a centromere. And each one has these little kinetochores that grab the spindle fibers. Too shit. Okay, that's prometaphase. You ready for metaphase? Let's do it. Metaphase, these things are grabbed onto the spindle fibers. Let me put a few spindle fibers here. Just yeah. For, yeah. <laughs> what about asters? Are you going to put those down? No. Yeah. Yes. Oh, that's Wait, oh. Oh, 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 you got it. You got it. Okay. Oh, it's uneven. Yeah, I know. No, it's put one on the other side now. No, I'm not doing it. Now, these things attach to the spindle fibers and wiggle their way along the spindle fibers and line up in the middle. That's metaphase. Ah, uh, no, do green, white, green, no. Nope. Jesse. Jesse. White, green, white. So that's metaphase and line up in the middle. Look at that big green one. <laughs> it's so messed up. <laughs> okay? It's pretty easy. Quick phase. Then anaphase, they separate. Pull apart. Oh. Pull apart. 
And move to the opposite side. Like when you broke up with your girlfriend in high school. That's right, like Anna. 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 That's what we call it. Anna and I yeah. move to opposite sides <laughs> of campus. <laughs> 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 and then finally, and this is the hardest phase, telephase. Or say, I don't know, prophase. Savage for a... Telephase. The chromosomes arrive at opposite ends. Cleavage for a forms. The chromosomes... Of, watch out for that. The chromosomes <laughs> arrive at opposite ends. Are they still called chromosomes? They're, still, they're called daughter chromosomes. Good question. They're called daughter chromosomes. You can also call them chromatids. Yeah, are they? Well, they were on, they're only called chromatids when they're, when they're together. together. Oh. Once they separate, they're daughter so chromosomes. That's ridiculous. What's another thing they're called when they're together? Like some other Together? Sister that's chromatids. a chromosome. There's, there's nothing, nothing. Sister chromatids. They're chromatin when they're not coiled Chromatin when they're not coiled out. Yeah. Just laying out. Um, um, oh. So they arrive at the opposite sides. A new nucleus forms around the chromosomes. Wait, what is this? A new nucleus. Is this a new nuclear envelope? A new nuclear envelope. A new membrane forms around the chromosomes. You can see it forming right here at either end. Why, do, why are we doing that? Well, they've arrived at opposite sides. They're where they need to be. They no longer need to be coiled up. They can flatten out and spread out. Because if you remember from a later chapter, that's the only way the DNA can be transcribed is when they're spread out. It can't be transcribed when they're coiled up. Remember heterochromatin and euchromatin? Yeah. Anyway, um, so, so they, they, they uncoil, spread back out into chromatin new nuclear membrane, and the spindle fibers, of course, all disappear in this phase. And the cell starts to pinch inward like this, on both sides. Or glasses. This is called a cleavage furrow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then we start cytokinesis, which is just basically Drawing of this line. <laughs> <laughs> Especially in plants with a cell plate. Which is like yeah, plants form a cell plate instead of pinching in. Just uh, just they they just back. build a new cell wall between the two cells. It's called a cell plate. So that that makes that a happen yeah. Isn't that the, um, what's the that goes around that breaks it? The ring? Yes, it's a uh, contractile ring. Okay. Definitely. Okay? Okay. Are we good? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's mitosis. Do you what what else do you want? I think I don't see how you can get enough words? Yeah. You can, I have it written down, okay. Okay, and I got it tonight. <laughs> I'll let you get a copy of mine. I'll let you get a copy of mine if you want. Okay, now, let's do meiosis. Meiosis is a little different. It's kind of sad. Guess what song I was reading on the way over here was Huh? Piano Man? Well, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That mitosis song, I'm trying to give you can we just like oh, yeah. start from? Can we start from that? And you still need to see the. Just kind of start from where they're broken up, and there's two. What's that bummer? Two cells. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah
But the different, the major difference is the chromosomes search each other out. They crawl along the, the spindle fibers, which I'm not showing here, but just imagine that they're there, until they find one another. And they pair up with their homologous pair. That one, the little one, pairs up with the other little one. The medium one pairs up with the other medium one. The big one pairs up with the other big one. This is still in prophase, right? This is still in prophase one. These are called homologous pairs. Homologous means they look the same. And they actually carry the same kinds of genes. For instance, if this one had a gene for eye color right there, this one would have a gene for eye color right, right there. Now, it's possible that this could have a blue eye color gene, and this could have a brown eye color gene, but the eye color gene is still on the homologous chromosomes. By homologous. Is that what synapsis is? Synapsis is when they come together. That's called synapsis. Is that how you get one brown eye and one blue eye? No. That's when you have a twin and a limb or something like that. Right. That's all like an <laughs> yeah. This could be. This could have a big B on it, and this could have a little B on it, and so the person would be big B, little B. Right. That's how you get one brown eye and one blue eye. No. no. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to Kathy. <laughs> Wait, so the tablet. Don't worry about how you get one brown eye. There's a lot of things in the world we haven't studied. Yet. What? Um. I wish I had that. that. Now. <laughs> Another thing happens during this. Oh, by the way, we call this a tetrad. That's, or a bi that's called a tetrad. It's also called a bivalent. That was where I was It's also called a homologous pair. It has three names. Just like I have three names. Mr. Willis, Tom Willis, and DJ Grandmaster T. <laughs> okay, so. Um, Wait, what's the first name of it? Synapsis, tetra, oh, tetrad, a bivalent, or a homologous, homologous pair. I like homologous pairs. I like bivalent. Yeah, fine. I like homologous pairs. They align themselves. Question, do we have to know all three? Oh. Yeah. They could ask anything on this exam, so. Okay. Maybe. Wait, how did you get these exams? Wow. Listen, don't ask questions you don't want to hear the answer to. So I'm guessing okay. they change it every year? I can't tell. Okay. You so could. Anyway, um, here's what happens during prophase one. The, the chromosomes actually, I'm showing them just together like this, but in actuality they're laying on top of one another. Oh, and, uh, and they will actually switch pieces, which and that's called crossing over. Like in baby geniuses. And so what that does is that creates variation. Still prophase one. It creates variation. It makes chromosomes that have never existed before. This is why you never get two kids that look the same. One reason is, see they all look different. I like the little white one. Which one's your favorite? That one. <laughs> I like the second one. That one. I like the third one. Actually. We decided on the one on the far right. I like the one. I actually like the one next to the one on the He's curious. Yeah, yeah, so so cool. 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 I agree. Mean, Okay. That's prophase one. Wait, do you have to say that it occurs on the chiasma? Uh, chiasma is where the crossing over occurs. It's a chiasma. <laughs> do you have to yeah. say that? You may. You may say it if you need extra words. Chiasmata. Chiasmata is plural. Chiasma is a singular. This, by the way, that's a good point. Listen. This crossing over doesn't just happen on one place. It averages about three or four places per chromatid. So imagine there's four white pieces on each of these chromatids. On all of these chromosomes. So you've created a lot of new variation there. The odds of getting two sperm cells that have the exact same crossing over is, is almost impossible. It's like one in trillions. Williams, if that's a word. Williams. Google. Okay, so then it's pretty easy after this. Metaphase one, they move along the spindle fibers and line up in the middle. 
Now, at this point, you may want to say something about something that Mendel called independent assortment. Yes. You remember that? Yeah. They don't have to line up. Green on each side, it just goes on. It, it doesn't yeah. have to be, it could end up where it's all white on one side and all green on the other. But it doesn't have to. It's random. Each pair is random the way it lines up. We call that independent assortment. And that actually happens during metaphase one, where they, they line up on the metaphase plate, is what we call that. Is independent, independent, like this This pair doesn't depend on that pair. They're independent of one another. Is independent smell, 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 like Independence Day? I got how much for this. I was just thinking of the song. ENT. Excuse me. ENT. Or I don't know. It might be ENT. Independent. What? No. Okay. One of those are so. Anaphase one. Wow. Listen. My turn. Joey. I have a quick question. Independent assortment is the process variation, and it was that was said by Linda. Yeah, because in in one cell that's doing this, you might end up with all whites on one side. Yeah. But in the next cell that does it, you might end up with two whites and a green. Oh. You see well, what I'm saying? Because like, you're shuffling up the chromosomes. So they all go to the same place. No, they don't. They're going to split up. They're going to end up four different chromosomes. Oh, did you, did you switch it that way? Yeah, like this. Oh, okay. That's you went up and down. Okay, that's it. Nope. Okay. 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 The, the homologous pairs separate and move to opposite sides. That's different also than mitosis. Because in mitosis, at this point, they split in the middle. The two sister chromatids split apart. But they don't do that here. The two homologs <laughs> split apart. I know why. Homologs. Homologs, do you like that word? <laughs> Then, telophase, basically, they huddle in the middle. It's just the same as telophase before. New nuclear membranes form. What happens to the chromosomes? They uncoil. They uncoil and spread out. It's the same. From here on in, it's, everything's the same as mitosis. It seems kind of pointless. The, the, uh, cell splits in two in, in a cytokinesis phase. If you want to put a cytokinesis phase here, that does happen. So it could be I PMAT C1 and then PMAT C2. Now, but we're only halfway through. But is it interkinesis? Yes, there's a, there's, a, there's a short interkinesis, which is just time where these things are just sitting here like this. Uncoiled. And centrioles coupled. Coast. Why are they uncoiled ah. when they just uncoil ah. here? Good point, Melinda Max. The centrioles have to copy themselves here. Good point. You forgot. Because we need a new a new pair to move to opposite sides again. So What's that does happen that in interkinesis. What's interkinesis. Interkinesis. During interkinesis. Those interkinesis. copy themselves. The centrioles do. What are those little things called? Which ones? Centrioles. centrioles. Or centrosomes, if you want to call them centrosomes. centrosomes. Either one would work. In, in, in animal cells, there's centrioles make up the centrosome. In plant cells, there are no centrioles, just centrosomes. What makes up the centrosome? They're little uh, weird looking, um, like, it looks like pieces of flagella is actually a short piece of a flagella. Okay. Little mi micro microtubules okay. in a nine plus zero arrangement. Whoa, mm. coach! Whoa. How long do <laughs> how long do the chromosomes go back and forth for? Does anyone know what nine? Because it seems kind of like wasted time. It is. They just they just do that because that's what they did in regular cell it's division. Procedure and this it's type like of cell division evolved from normal cell division. Okay. So they're gonna do what's ever in that protein. Cell division. It, it seems pointless. Yeah, okay. it pretty much is. Okay. okay, so the next thing that happens is uh, we go to prophase two, and these 
Centrioles move to opposite sides. Shoot out spindle fibers. Just like before. The nuclear membrane dissolves. Just like before. Spindle fibers shoot out. Attached to the chromosomes. Everything in, in these phases is the same as mitosis. Exactly the same. Except it produces four. If you were if you were use so much room on your essay for the first part, you could just say to, to, to save some time in the second part. The second the, look at my the, the next phases are just like mitosis. See mitosis. Um, if you if but don't do that if you don't have enough words. Go back through the whole thing. Just repeat it. Anyway, metaphase two, they line up in the middle. And I like to do them crossways like this, because it's but because it's easy, it's less confusing. But but they could they could line up this way again and split that way. Anaphase two, they actually split at the centromere now, and now we have daughter chromosomes moving to opposite sides. Telophase two. They arrive at their opposite sides. New nuclear envelopes. New nuclear envelopes form. What's the nuclear envelope made out of? Uh, phospholipids. He said that they cuddle together. All yeah. membranes inside the cell are yeah, phospholipid bodies. Like the invaginization or something. Yeah, it's, 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 it's invagination. Every membrane, Joey, inside a cell is a phospholipid body. Uh, those are the only membranes. Even in like the little um, vesicles. Like, yes. Yeah. Cool. Now this thing pitches in. Yes. All membranes. Totally going in my head. All membranes are phospholipid membranes. All membranes. Weird. Endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi apparatus, vacuoles, vesicles, plasma membrane, mitochondrial, Christi, the inner membrane, the outer membrane. Okay. Systems. This one's the. Yes. This one's the. Are you just saying everything? Now listen. Look at what we have. We have four cells. With half the number of chromosomes. We started with six. Now we only have three. That's half. Good man. Notice that they're all different. This has two whites and a green. This has two greens and a white. This has. Two whites and a green with a piece of green. No. This has two greens and a white with a piece of white. All four different. Awesome. They're each going to grow a little tail if they grow oh, into yeah, a sperm. And they're ready to invade an egg <laughs> upon ejaculation. <laughs> always, like, wait for Just got real quiet. <laughs> <laughs> like, we'll study that in chapter 43. Oh, you're fine. You say that. You know, and I think it's wrong. I think it's 42. 42. I don't think it is 43. I think you always say 43. But yeah. I think it was 43 in the previous edition. Yeah. You moved it around. I remember I talked about Okay, that's, that's it. No, you are. Yeah, you are. Coach. Yeah. When did we learn about like how the egg was born? Um, that was. Uh, uh, That's the uh, uh, Genesis stuff. Yeah, that was in one of the genetic chapters. No, that was in this chapter. Yeah, page 177. Oh, Genesis. 177. See the naked people on 177? Oh, there they are. See? Okay, you ready for uh, genetics problems? No. Do you want to take a little break? Yeah, go get some water or something. Go to the bathroom. Go stand up. Do something. Do something. I've got stuff to hand out here. What kind of practice problem sheet? What I write. No, I don't. Does anyone have 50 cents? 
I don't remember anything. What is it? Whose is this? Did you read it? I mean, yeah, it kind of sounds fine. I was having a deja vu moment. It's strange that you basically wrote the same thing twice. Very strange. <laughs>